music, adventure music, music for open-minded people. Show Club IT report, and this time I have the pleasure to interview Senor Kakanat or Uwe Schmidt. I don't know what's better. How shall, how shall I call you now? Uh, I prefer Atom. Atom, Atom. What's about? Uh, Atom. That's uh, my main, uh, the main name I'm using, and it's the easiest language-wise. And uh, what about Senor Kakanat? Um, that's just uh, that's just an image. Uh, you know, it's not it's not my name. Uh, I, I'm not. I don't like to be subsumized under that name. <laughs> Senor Coconut, I would describe uh, with a word <coughs> which I have invented, which was Electro Latino. Cha, cha, cha. Well, I come more from the track-oriented, um, like techno pop, uh, industrial music, etc., etc. Got a bit annoyed about uh, techno, I would say. '94, I founded my own label, rather interesting, and I did a lot of very, very strange stuff on that label always. And then my change to Chile didn't have much to do with Senor Coconut. Uh, Senor Coconut was born before. And uh, it's very often people think it's the same thing. I went to Chile and I had this idea or something. But Chile has, doesn't have much to do with Senor Coconut. Senor Coconut presents Coconut F in some tunes of uh, Bailey Funk. How did you know this sound and, and what's your impressions about this? When I have to do vacations, I'm going to Brazil always to have vacations. And, and this friend of mine, he's a, he's a producer and he, he showed me this music. This was like five years ago. And I was quite fascinated by the music. It's music by poor people um, and it's, it's a massive movement, although it's not very popular outside of the city or or the country. What I like about it is that it lacks any so-called uh, professional point of uh, production skills. It doesn't sound like anything I would do or anybody in Europe would do because it's so it's very, really rough and spontaneous. Senor Coconut Insolent! If you compare this album with the last three albums, I try to maybe bring the experience of the last album together uh, on this album and create a more complex um, sound. That's also the reason why I wanted to invite more people to participate. Well, how was this uh, production process? We recorded the basic material in uh, Germany, in Cologne, for like two weeks. Then I recorded the, vo the vo vocals with Argenis Brito. Argenis Brito? Like he came to Santiago. And all the guest appearances uh, we sent away through internet, basically. Like I sent the mixes to Japan, they recorded and sent the mixes back and stuff like that. Senor 
coconut is a cha 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 and stuff, but it's more European, you know, it's not, it doesn't have this salsa brava flavor. Maestro, please let them cha cha cha. Senor Coconut, in a way, is a very twisted project. Ooh, yeah, baby! The main idea of Senor Coconut is to, to recreate uh, all this music that a Latin band would never do. I think the combination of all the things is making it work worldwide. Muy bien, muy bien, el mejor yo creo. Hay que venir al Sonar y a Barcelona, es el festival más cool. I want to say thank you to Barcelona for having us all here and providing the most fantastic festival. Un saludo. Peace. Sonar 2006. This is really, really, really a dream. We are here at Raval. Many nice people, cool people. Goose here by my side from Mexico. Hi, Goose. <laughs> Hi, how are you? <laughs> now we have a party around, around the city, the art party, electronic music. We create something in fusion of a lot of designers and we put an atmosphere with electronic music. What's the name of the place? Uh, Distrito Quinto. Distrito Quinto. Let's go there. Let's go there. Okay. <laughs> As you can see here, there is a mobile phone. Yeah, we, 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 we can touch that. It's really great. Yeah. In the first part is the architectonic studio. In the, in the down there is the way where we play and we create things. This is the Barcelona and Berlin Art, the gallery. Upstairs is the architecture design studio and in here in this park is like a cultural center. Destruction with love. Destruction but with art, but with but destruction but constructing. We are creating songs about love. <laughs> I love it. Muchas gracias. Igual. Gracias. Chao. Chao. First summer where I found a place to do a beach party every Sunday, so it's cool. Tell me more about your new album. When is when is it coming out? Uh, it's going to come out in September, and uh, I think it's the best one we've made yet. Free parties, warehouse parties. It gets you back into the houses that you used to love, you know. And it's, uh, so that's come out on the new record for sure. Here every Sunday on the beach when I'm when I'm in town, I'm here. And uh, there's another uh, party called the Estate Party in a warehouse in Bobbleno, and I do that whenever I can as well. See you, bye. Woohoo! Peace!